We have an update on a woman who was arrested for allegedly stealing credit cards at a yoga studio and going on a spending spree. The charges have been dropped. Local 10's Rosh Lowe reports. Several weeks ago, we were there when Angelina Giambri was arrested by South Miami police, accused of grand theft. Her dad at the time said cops have the wrong person. The state attorney's office agrees and drops the charges. Now we hear from Angelina and we hear from South Miami police. The first thing I have in my face is a bright light blinding me. Then I have a gentleman feeling up on me all in between my thighs, my legs, you know, feeling up on me and another one restraining me and one is smoking a cigarette while they're restraining me. How is that professional? Angelina Giambri says she has been vindicated. I'm not surprised. I had no attachment to the crime. The Miami-Dade State Attorney's Office dropping charges against her related to a grand theft case in South Miami where she was accused of stealing a purse from a yoga studio and going on a high-priced shopping spree, picking up thousands of dollars worth of purses with a stolen credit card at the Daylin Mall. She's innocent with an ironclad alibi. They arrested the wrong person. So if she says, I'm totally in the clear, what do you say? We'll, we'll find out. We were with South Miami police when they arrested her. They said they received a Crime Stoppers tip and had a witness ID, Giambi. We didn't get it wrong. Uh, we did our investigation. Uh, she was positively ID'd by a witness who was face to face with her. But Giambi says she has an alibi. She says she was on a boat and provides this photo time stamped 1136 AM. This was the same time period she was accused of the theft. She also had restaurant receipts from that day. I saw that video. Um, the times are close, but uh, it could still be her. Uh, I'm continuing my investigation. I'm waiting for additional video. It's a veteran officer who rushed to judgment based upon one identification of a witness. If they say this is bad policing, this is irresponsible, you say to them? This is not bad policing at all. I proved that I was innocent before I was even in jail, and his words where I've been here since 8 a.m. I want to go home, so you're going to jail. Angelina says that she just simply wants to go on with her life. Obviously, she's very concerned about how South Miami police handled the situation. South Miami police, on the other hand, say, as you heard from the sergeant there, this is an ongoing investigation. We're live in downtown Miami. I'm Rosh Lowe, Local 10 News. Okay.